everyone, it's me Molly and today in this video I'm going to teach you guys how to do a handstand so let's get started before I start this video make sure you give it a big thumbs up if you like it so let's get started so the first thing you would need to do if you want to get really good at your handstand is to stretch your whole body Keep it here for five seconds. If you don't want to stretch out your whole body, the main thing you need to stretch out is your wrists. Keep it here for at least 10 seconds. Okay. to do is I'm sure you all know how to salute. Now you're going to go in a T. So stay there for five seconds. If you can't do it then keep trying and then you'll get is you need to go in a needle so keep doing that until you feel you're comfortable with that Sometimes I kick up. Okay, so as soon as you've done that, you need to kick up a tiny bit. Kick up as high as you can, um, high as you can when you feel comfortable. So basically, maybe you could go like this. Very low to start off. So keep doing that again. Now you would probably want a wall, but I'm not going to have a wall. You need to bring both of your legs up as high as you can and try and let your um, feet um, go off the wall and and try and balance yourself. So as I say, I'm not going to do it against the wall. So, yeah. More likely, if you don't use a wall, you would sometimes go on a bridge or something else. You might want to do it on a mat in case you're getting scared or something. So if you, if you felt you were tipping over a bit, you might as well go on a bridge. But if you don't feel comfortable with that, then try and kick your legs over. Well, no, that's not a good example. Wait, one more time, guys. 
try and go like that if you don't feel comfortable going in the bridge if you feel the need to. So. Now we're going to be talking about um, how to keep your handstands long. So what you need to do is um, when you're um, doing your handstand, because you use your hands, you would need to move them around like that. You would see, see me doing this, that on this handstand. Well, no, that's not a good one. I'm on a hill, so that's not really like. Go, go, stay up there until you um you feel you need to go down. So if you want to get really clever in yourself, you could do a press handstand if you want. But that's not the whole video for today. Is that? That's what you'll be mainly doing. If you have the need, you would probably go on a bridge. Then practice the bridge and practice your handstands. And maybe you want to do on the trampoline to help you. But that doesn't always help you because it's bouncy and it will let you surf on the floor. So maybe you have a gymnastics mat or something. I'm getting a gymnastics mat and gymnastics bars. So... Yeah. So one more time guys. And also you can do a side um you can do it in the split. Hope you enjoyed this week's video. Comment down below. <laughs> um, comment down below. Um, did I give you some good tips how to help you on your handstands? I hope I did. Give this a big thumbs up.